Ta-da! Hello everybody, good afternoon, welcome back to the channel. My name's Jason Sebastian and this is Butterfly Square Garden, a place where you can be free to be yourself. Do a little butterfly. That's butterfly in sign language. Okay, so as you could see, look at this spread. What did we do in our last video? In our last video, we unpinned some butterflies and then glued them into these wonderful petri dishes and now we have these butterflies here's one that I had done last year that's from a year ago um, and it's still pretty much in perfect condition so aren't butterflies weird they just don't really decompose so um, I did these off camera just a minute ago um, they all came out of these hydration boxes that I have over here. Um, I had some butterflies. They died of natural causes. They live a long time. Two months. Um, I fed them and I gave them plants for them to lay eggs on. So as you can see, they are very well taken care of. I'm just getting that out of the way, making space. Same thing, I'm going to get these out of the way, make some space for the video, but I just wanted to start off with a fun little intro of that sort, put them away to be safe. I'm actually giving them away as a gift to my friend who gave me swallowtail eggs. She does swallowtails, I do monarchs, but I do all sorts of butterflies. So, I was going to do a video um, showing how to pin butterflies out of a hydration box, but when I went to check on my butterflies, this one had just died, and when they just die, um, that's the easiest time to pin them. So, I'm going to see if I can really, really quickly do this monarch, and then I'm going to get back into pinning some swallowtails, because those are what I need to do first. I have done quite a few butterfly videos with you guys um, by now. Oh look, there's a little stain. I think that might be a Gatorade stain. So, what is the important part when pinning butterflies? I like to start by pinning the head in place. And then, it might be too soon to do the feelers, so... What I like to do next is to kind of just pin one side down. And then pin the other side down. And this kind of just stops it from moving around. They're so light that they just move around so much. Okay, let's get that out from under the paper. And for the antennas, we want them to be in a nice little V on top, just perfectly pointed forwards. So let's do that real quickly. Do, do, do. All right, so that's pretty good. That was done well so far. Let's see if we can continue the momentum. I literally just pinned four butterflies like one second ago, so I'm pretty warmed up. Gotta say, pretty, pretty warmed up. I want to pull it all the way up. And then pin it down. Pin it down. That's actually not, I'm going to have to move that pin later, but it's you know, it's fine for now. I do 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 now we're doing the other side la 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 pull it up 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 more 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 perfect that's where I want it right there so this isn't an exact science. It's closer to an art form. I don't like how unstable this is at all. 
I was going to try to use less needles because I have a lot of butterflies to pin, but I mean, it's better if you use more. That's just the way it is. Bum, bum, bum. I like the way. I like the way. Now I'm literally going to have to move this even though I just pinned it. <clears throat> Let's see how careful we can be. So I'm pulling it up, pulling it up, pulling it up. Till there's just a little tiny V. Ba -ba -da -da -ba -ba. Now I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. And pull, pull, pull. You totally can't see what I'm doing, but... La -la 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 -la. I actually like how I did that better on this side. So I'm going to see if I can recreate what I just did. Uh oh, using my left hand. I'm using my left hand. Oh my god, everybody. But it was okay. Because I wanted to get the pins on the inside. You see what I'm saying? And you can see it's got perfect little V's. Um, so now I'm just going to finish off nailing it down as much as I can. Like, honestly. Usually less is more, but when you're pinning down butterflies, more is more. Just do it. Just do it. And again, usually tracing paper helps a lot. Uh, but I don't have any pin and pin. And then the last thing to do which is actually pretty important, is putting pins underneath the ab... I think it's the abdomen. A little tail. The booty. Um, so that when it dries out, it doesn't fall down and become flaccid and limp. We don't like th flaccid butterflies. So that was quick. We did that really fast. I'm going to take a sip of mate. So yeah, that butterfly just died today. It wasn't dried out. Look what we have here. Not that one though. We'll start with this one. La 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 la. It's a hydration box. It's just a Chinese food container. Let's open that really carefully. And then um, I've got really gently taking this off. A paper towel and I sprayed it um, I had a, a spray bottle with water and just a little bit of pine saw because otherwise they can get moldy mole 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 it's late and I'm pinning butterflies so I need to entertain myself la, 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 la. let's get this back out of the way we will pin you in a second. This is going to be a marathon video, guys. Like, I've got a lot of butterflies to pin. So next, what I do is I dab it. Is this the best my phone can focus? It's literally the best my phone can do. So this guy looks pretty dry. Usually I dab it with a paper towel, but there's really not much water droplets on this one. So really, really carefully move them. Like seriously, be so careful, everybody. I do 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 do. I'm kind of poking it into the hole a little bit. Oh no! You can see the wing is starting to to break. But that okay? That okay? I'm moving it up a little bit. Because again, space is limited. I don't have an infinite amount of space. Um, but it's not like I'm going to be working all night long. Start. That might have been a little too. Oh well. I'll put that there. 
So now I pinned above its head and then like under its arms, wings, whatever. So I don't think that's going to go anywhere. Um, but just to be safe, you know what I like to do, I pin them down first and then I move it around. And a pin pin here and a pin pin there. Here a pin, there a pin, everywhere a pin pin. Old MacDonald had a pin. Yeah, yeah, it's already wetting the paper. Uh oh. And it's wetting that one too. Uh oh. I've noticed that when you try to pin a wet butterfly, that when you unpin them, it tends to stick to the paper. So you need to be very, very careful when you're unpinning them. So we start with the antennas, everybody, just like we discussed before. We just don't want them moving around, you know? I just, I don't want it moving. Hello, my on screen, hello. All right, next, next, next. Very carefully, pulling up my left side. Whoops, I'm moving all the frickin' needles around while I work. Not good. So I kind of hold the bottom wing down while I pull the top wing up. Ooh, that was, I think, a good one. Pinning it down, because I don't want it to move. I don't want it to move. <coughs> Let us do the other side now. I mean, very, 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 very carefully. It's like they're made out of wet tissue paper. That's what I feel like I'm working with right now. A do 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 I'm just gonna pin them down in that one spot because it's gonna move. I just know it. All right, let's see how this goes over here. Do 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 do. Pin this down over here. <gasps> I moved it. It's okay. I do 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 For some reason this one's like all spotted. It's like totally effed up. Oh well, oh well. I think I'm done. Let's just pick this little butt up a little bit more. And I wish I could turn the head, but I kind of can't. Uh, I definitely just ruined it. No, I didn't. Be very careful. Wow, I can't believe I did that. I just picked the head up like a millimeter, but that's, ugh. It's so precise. I love it. I love my job. Two down. Really six down. This is, I, I'm doing a lot today. Let's keep it moving. Keep it moving. Take a sip of water. I mean, tea. 
<coughs> I just choked. <coughs> Drink green tea, it's good for your health. <coughs> Unless you choke to death. Don't do that. Going back into my hydration chamber. Boy, oh boy. These have been, like, really weighing on my mind lately. I'm like... Because they'd... The butterflies, when they died, I was like, Oh my god, I have to pin them right away, but I don't have the energy. So I kind of just set them aside and let them dry out. And then I was like, oh no, they're dry. I can't pin them. What am I going to do? I'm too lazy to make a hydration chamber. So I just let them sit out for a couple weeks. And then I was like, oh my god, now I'm, I have the energy to do the hydration chamber. So I just did all as many as I could. I didn't even get all of them. And I filled up my fridge. Um, yeah, for some reason, like, I had worked with butterflies a lot at all stages. And the hydration chamber was, like, the last thing that I was just like, oh, I don't want to learn how to do that. It's just too much work. But it really, it's not that much work, you know? And the more practice you get, the easier it gets. You know, the less effort it takes to do stuff. So now that I'm done dabbing, they usually have like such beautiful blue on the bottom, but you can barely see it. This whole thing. It's worn out. You can see it. It's very, very worn out. Move this freaking pin out of the way. So, for whatever reason, when these two butterflies died, they died with their wings open. And that, like, never happens. Um, usually when they die, their wings fold up. And that's how you know that they're dead. Whoa, I'm, like, poking the shit out of this guy. That's alright, that's okay. And then what do we do next, class? That's right, we pin it down. Um, <clears throat> so it's definitely important to have the pine saw on the wet paper towels, like I mentioned, because otherwise they do get moldy. And I was telling the story about how I had put them in the hydration chamber after I did that, I literally left them alone for weeks. You only need to let them hydrate for a couple days, but I let them in. I left them alone for like two weeks, um, and I was scared to check on them, you know, because sometimes fear is the worst. So I finally checked on them, and they weren't dry and crusty and brittle like I thought they were gonna be. They were like actually malleable, so. But then I saw that there was a little bit of mold on a couple of them, so I was like, oh my god, I have to pin all of them, like, tonight. <laughs> so I have, like, 100 butterflies. No, it's probably close to, like, 20 or 30, but that's still a lot to do at once. All right, can we do it? Can we bring this wing up? When they're wet, they kind of stick to each other, so that's why I, I press down on the bottom wing just till they separate. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay, I think that's good. And then... I'm going to lift this one, and then I'm going to pin the top of the wings like I did. I like that system. I gotta say, I'm getting pretty good at pinning butterflies, my friends. I'm getting better and better and better. So I put the papers too close together, but that's okay. And a pin pin here, and a pin pin there. Here a pin, there a pin, everywhere a pin, pin. Old MacDonald had a pin. Hmm. 
this one's a little higher than this one, so guess what we're gonna do? Oh, I think it just fell. I think it slid down a little bit. A do 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 and a do do do. That's why I wanted to pin them down like this, so that they don't move around. A little shifty shifty. All right, now that mother ain't going nowhere. Same thing on this side. La 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 la. If anyone, oh crap! Fuck! I tapped it and it shifted down just a little bit, just enough for me to be like, "How the freaking hell did that happen?" It's because I didn't pin it down well enough. That's better. That's better. Now that ain't going nowhere. Alright. I also don't like the way that I did that antenna. He's got one and a half antenna. The other one's broken. So. <coughs> now let's move up the bottom wing. Ah, so beautiful. So beautiful. Um for this one, uh oh. Fix the little booty. And then I'm going to do, if I can fit, I don't think I can. I can't fit it. Oh, well. I split up my paper. I'll do it this way. Because you want to get as much of it flattened out as possible. So, you know, the butterflies are not always the same, so sometimes you gotta do it different. Alright, I think we did it. I kinda wanna move this other little half antenna like there. All right, we are moving right along. I'm exhausted. It's okay. So, I've got another hydration chamber. Yay. Is there a swallowtail? I know there's at least one more swallowtail. Let's see. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, here they are. Do 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 do, my dead butterfly friends. <laughs> Next, I'm gonna do this male baby, and you can see there's a white spot on his butt right there. Um, if you can, maybe I'll get a little closer. Nope, you can't see it. Well, if I zoom in, my focus. So yeah, you can see right there. That's a spot of mold. And I'm like, hell no. I ain't about to lose my butterflies. So I'm going to pin as many as I can tonight. And then whatever's left over, I'm going to pin tomorrow. Unless I run out of mounting board and pins. I might run out of pins. And then it's like, I'm going to have to wait four or five days for the butterflies to dry out before I can do more again. 
but it's like they might all be lost to mold at that point. So this one died with its wings closed. And this is like the hardest way to do a butterfly because you need to, you know, spread the wings like so, but they just close again. So I think what I'm going to try to do, oh my god, I really shouldn't be doing this. There. That was hard to do. And it's moving it up very gently. Very, very gently. Oh my goodness. Wowie wow. Yeah, hopefully that mold, like, dries up. Because <coughs> there isn't much I could do about it. I don't want to ruin, like, the butterflies. Like I said, it's pretty much like working with wet paper, um, wet tissue paper. I'll do a little dabby dabby. Get out of here, mold. It's like there's really, it's not doing anything. So, how do we start pinning our butterflies class? That's right. We gotta nail it down first before you do anything. That's just how I like to start. I do, 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 boo, 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 boo. I wish I could do this live. I really wanted to do a live pinning and mounting, but like, you know, the cameras weren't working. It was all like glitchy, so really, ow, I just fucking poked myself with the pin. I, did you see me do that? That was freaking hilarious. Um, that happens sometimes. Danger, danger. I love my job, but sometimes you poke yourself with a needle. I'm not bleeding, it's fine. Just a little fun. Funniness. A do 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 pitting up this other antenna. I found out that butterflies have different kinds of antennas, just like they have different colored eggs. Um, you'd think they're all exactly the same, but they're not. Let's pin this guy in place. Oops. We might move those later, but I just, I don't want him, and it is a him, moving around. Boop, 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 boop. Hello. Alright, so I grab it with my paddle nose tweezers. And it's got what's called the scent. Oh crap, did you see that? I just moved the whole butterfly. Ah, it's so stressful. No, it's fine. I'm kidding. And a pin pin here, and a pin pin there, here, a pin there, a pin everywhere, a pin pin. So what did we learn from the last butterfly? Um, we didn't pin the corners down um, immediately. Ugh, I don't like. There we go. Yeah, we didn't pin it down immediately and it shifted. So boo-hoo, let's not do that again. Yay, we're doing so good, everybody. And the more you pin it down, the the less it moves around and the easier it is to pin it down. <gasps> oh, crap. I, like, can't get under. Shit. It's like pressing down or something. There we go. Hold your breath while you do this. No, don't. Don't hold your breath. So I pull it all the way up. 
and I put a pin and another pin. Yeah, I think that's a good spot. I think that's good. <clears throat> so yeah, I don't like to think about this in terms of money, but each butterfly is worth... Ow, I just pinned... I stabbed myself again. Um, Each butterfly is worth over $30, but I don't like to think of them that way. I just think it's kind of wrong. It's like if I died and people were like, oh, his body is worth X amount of money. It's like, that's wrong. And the pin pin there. And I think I would be happy pinning it down like so. And don't just drop your pins on the table like I'm doing, because you're going to freaking knock them over and lose them. Just be responsible and put them back in the foam. A boop, 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 do, do, boop, do, 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 do. There's like, ugh. This wing is like held together by a thread. It's like barely together. Yay! We're doing so well, everybody. I'm so happy. I literally thought that like all of my butterflies had turned to garbage because I just I let them dry out and I was so mad at myself because it's like this year we got so many butterflies um, but then it was like oh no I have so many butterflies pinning them out and I was working so hard to take care of them that I just I didn't really have the energy to pin them in the end of the day um, so I just let them dry out but I'm really happy that whatever blah 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 it's working so do 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 it just always looks out of focus I wish I could focus better and ba -ba -da 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 -da. yeah they're totally getting moldy but Oh, well, I think if I pin them all by tomorrow, we wouldn't have lost any. Do you guys procrastinate? Because I literally, like, apparently wait till the last second to do way too many things. Um, as I said, this one, if their wings are folded up then it's easy to push them down but when their wings are pushed down you have to open them up and that's like like I just showed you it's harder to do but if I can com recreate what I just did before There we go. Ah, see how see what I'm talking about? It ain't so easy. It's a fun job, but it's it's not easy. So here's what I'm going to do. Wow, this one is a uh, a tough cookie. This is a tough cookie, everybody. But I'm pretty confident that we could do it. There we go. It's like after you've worked with them for long enough, you just start to understand like the physics of the body. I don't know, what am I trying to say? 
I do 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 do. I'm bummed this guy lost his antennas. What's a butterfly without an antenna? Ugly. No, I'm kidding. I do 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 do. Poo boo poo boo. If I only had a brain. La 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 la. This one was really wet when I started working with it. A boop 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 Oh, it's like, what's going on? Are you really that stuck? There we go. Ah, it's moving around. <laughs> this is going to be a weird one, guys. La 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 la. But we're trying our best. It's like, what am I supposed to do? Wait around for the butterflies to die? No, I would come back and I would just see them dead. You know, I can't just sit around and wait for them to die. Do 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 Okay. This is gonna be an iffy one. Oh wait, no, it's it's going fine. Hmm. Not bad, not bad. I don't like that the wing is over the paper, so I'm going to have to remember to to start at the bottom and go up as I remove the butterflies. Does that make sense? Boop, 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 boop. Be really careful when working with needles. I almost stabbed myself in the face. <laughs> Isn't this funny? Okay, so now very, very carefully. Do 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 do. Uh, they're so wet. It's like good and bad. It's like wow, the hydration chamber worked so well. Uh-oh, the hydration chamber worked so well. <laughs> uh, this is not perfect, but I'm quite satisfied with it. Because if every pork chop were perfect, we wouldn't have hot dogs. Ta-da! Uh, much better at this than I used to be, everybody. I used to tear these butterflies up. But I also, I was working with painted ladies. <gasps> oh, I just ripped it! I just ripped it! No! This one is like, what the fuck? Why do you suck so bad? Ugh, I'm rubbing it so much. There's going to be no pigment left. By the end. Oh, well. Oh, well, oh, well, oh, well. Let's. Nail it down. Ta-da! Oh my goodness, we just did one, two, three, four swallowtails and one monarch. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I've done nine butterflies today so far. 
And I gotta keep going. Let's just admire the work that we've done so far. Wow. I'm just so happy that um, I didn't ruin them. <laughs> I really thought I would have ruined all of them. Um, what the fuck's going on with my computer? Give me one second to put these in a safe spot. I literally just put them behind me. It's not that safe, but it's better than nothing. I can't have it in my spot. So I'm going to keep going. I've got another mounting board right here. And I've got... Which one do I want to do next? Do I have any more swallowtails? Because i got to finish the swallowtails first, everybody. I do 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 Oh my god, this paper towel is like dry, but the mo the butterflies are wet. Ah, they're getting moldy. No. Mold is bad. I don't know what's going to happen to these butterflies after I pin them. But I think that once they dry out, the mold will stop bothering them. But that really just means that I'm going to be pinning butterflies, like, all night. Do, 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 So, I'm going to dry this guy off with my paper towel. Dry, 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 dry. A do be do be do be a do ba do ba do Boop 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 Yep, it's moldy alright. Shucks. You live and you learn. I figure it's better than nothing, you know. Drink green tea, I'm really tired, it's late. So, this one is also got its wings closed, so I want to do that. I used to just pin them upside down, but I don't, I don't like doing that. Not one bit. So, how am I going to do this? I'm like screaming in my head. Ah. <clears throat> I was so close. I liked it, but I want to move it up a little bit more. I'm like, if I can do it once, I can do it again. Right? Ah, oh, shit fuck, everybody. Shit fuck. Ugh, little bitch. But I gotcha. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, 
We'll try our best. I do 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 we do 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 do. I really hope this mold is invisible after it dries out, everybody. So pin the head in place. Next, I'm gonna. I really don't like to do the antennas because sometimes it moves around. So. Which side should I start with? I'm going to start with the right side. I know I've been doing the left up until now, but the right side clearly needs to be shifted up by a lot. So I just pull the wing up until... oh fuck! I'm going off the board. I gotta move it down. <sighs> and it was in such a good spot before, and I thought I could do good if I moved it up, and I didn't. I did bad. I did bad. Oh man, that was so easy. Why didn't I do it that way the first time? You just grab one side. And then you use the board to hold it down. Yay, that was much, much, much better. I wonder... Nope, definitely can't. Nope, don't do that. I wonder if I can just jump right in. No, always do your best to put it correctly I did it again but whatever and by it again I mean you can see it's going off the board but you live and you learn and you learn and you live A boodly doodly 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 doodly. So I want to nail this down right where it is. Oh my god. And now let's do the other side. A doobly doobly doobly, a doobly doobly. How is this even possible? It's still going off. Man, the freaking hell. That sucks. But it's kind of too late. <clears throat> I think it'll be okay. I mean, like, not much choice. Like, I want it to be good, but I don't really care that much. Why did I do that? Hmm. Yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Now let's pull this one up. A do 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 do. Last but not least, pick up the abdomen. It's 
Ta-da! That's going to bend a little bit, but maybe not. And you can totally see there's just like a little bit of mold on the freaking butt. I don't think it makes that much of a difference. I do, 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 do. Do we want to pin it down even more? Would that change anything? No, I don't care. I'm going to leave it, everybody. So, how long does this video want to be? Am I going to do a two hour video of just pinning butterflies? Because that's what it's looking like. Do, 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 do. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, I think that's all of the swallowtails. So I'm kind of done for the night. The rest, oh shit, they're like, I mean, how much mold can pop up in the next 24 hours? A lot. That's why I got to do as much as I can tonight, everybody. But it's going by pretty fast. I do 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 do. Getting back into the game. Now I'm doing this little butterfly man. Or woman. Dabby dabby dabby. Ugh, man. Look at all that mold. This one's like white. White with mold. But it's good practice. Freaking like every single one of them was in this position, but judging by the practice that we just did, I think let's try. I couldn't do it. First, let's open it up. Okay, okay, I'm just trying to get the feel. It's definitely ready. Ta da! Cool, I can even let go. Look at that! I don't like that these papers are here, but we're just going to work on top of them. That's what I think. A dooby 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 do. Repetition, that's how you learn everybody. And repeat and rinse and repeat and rinse and repeat. And rinse and repeat. Put them on either side of the head. We want to make the antenna's nice and attractive. Pin them down so they don't go nowhere. I'm going straight on top of the paper from the butterfly that we just did before. <coughs> Okay, moment of truth. This is like the hardest part. Doing the, f well, other than putting it down. But I just want to pull it up. Perfect. So like you guys can't really see, but this monarch is so small. It's smaller than the swallowtail, and they're usually bigger than the swallowtails. So what I learned this year is that if a butterfly, I think, if a caterpillar feels like it's run out of food, it can metamorphosize early. You know, like if it hasn't grown to its full size, as a caterpillar, it can still be like, eh, you know, 
good enough, and then it'll go into a chrysalis. I didn't know they could do that, so that's something that I learned this year. Uh, butterflies of all different sizes, and they're the same species, so. A doobly 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 do. Um, as much as I think little butterflies are cool, I want to see how big I can get the monarchs. Like, what if you can get them to be giants? If you selectively breed them, and they just get bigger and bigger. It all depends on the food, you know? If I give them a ton of, of milkweed, then they're giants. But um, any other food source, and they're just like, I don't like this as much. They don't really eat and grow as fast. Can you see what I'm doing here? I'm just really gently nudging, nudging it up. I think this wing is wet, so it's not really moving. I'm definitely concerned that when I try to unpin them, they're all going to stick all over to the paper and to the board, but I mean, if I'm careful, I should be able to, to undo them. Now we're doing this side. It's like, come on. I know you could do it. There. Right there. Um, and then I pinned it down that so much easier with tracing paper but I don't have any okay yay one more down Boy, is this fun or what, everybody? I'm exhausted. <laughs> and we're about to run out of paper. I'm going to have to cut some more. Oh my god, it's an hour long video. After this butterfly, I'm going to cut the video. But I'll probably keep working into the night. I just, uh, I won't talk to you guys. I'll be listening to music. I will finish with, look, there's two more who are folded down, and this one's folded up, so maybe it'll be fun to do that. I do, 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 you guys, seriously, I still have, like, eh, not that many. Maybe there's, like, maximum 10 or 12 more butterflies to pin tonight, but seriously, five, six, seven, we did a lot. I don't know the most I've done in one day, but this is definitely the most big butterflies because I used to do a lot of painted ladies. For those of you who don't know my history, um, I did order some painted lady caterpillars from, I think, Nature's Treasures or something, Nature Valley. But they sell painted ladies because they're just like cheap and easy. Monarchs are not as cheap and easy. I thought about being like a distributor because butterfly houses like the Bronx Zoo, that's the only one that I'm familiar with. Um, they buy, oh crap, I almost, oh, I almost broke the antenna. That was so stressful. Um... Butterfly houses buy their butterflies from distributors, and as much as I think that that's like a really awesome idea and career, I just, I don't want to sell my butterflies. I don't think that's right. This is a sanctuary, you know, we're protecting them. 
This one is like, I do not want to open up my wings. So the way that I do this is... Oh, man, and the legs are sticking out, too. This guy's all over the place. Bad butterfly. <laughs> of course, I pick, like, the hardest one to end the video on. So I'm just really, really carefully going to open it up. And this is what I tell you guys. Sometimes you got to finagle it. But I'm getting better at learning how to do that. As you can see. With my flawless execution. Just kidding. It wasn't a flawless execution. Can you see how sideways it is? But... The point is to get it down. You want to nail it. You just want to get it, you know, moving in the right direction. This guy's sticking his little foot up. Like, why? And look how wet that paper is. I'm going to totally um, get a new piece of paper. I don't like that. Oh, no. Stay the fuck where you are, little bitch. I probably could have kept the paper, but I just didn't like it. Do a little dabby dabby in the corner. I can see how wet. How wet it is. I'm going to get these antennas out of the way because now we're gonna pull the wings up in like one second. <sighs> Don't do that. Maybe this is going to be longer than an hour video, guys. Depends. Depends on what? What does it depend on? I'm the only one who watches these videos. Like, who are you anyway? Flo, 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 flo. I'm going to make an attempt to pull this wing up, everybody. Wish me luck. Ah, I'm screaming. So that's where I want the wing to be. I'm like not even on screen. Sorry, everybody. Do, 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 do. This is a toughie, though. I just freaking hit it with my finger. Whew, we're getting there. We're getting there. I mean, no one ever said raising butterflies and then mounting and pinning them was easy. But then again, like, what? <laughs> ooh, 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 yes, yes, yes. Ah, oh, perfect. Yes, I love that when it just works out. Okay, now let's do this right wing. I think we can do it. Like, no problems. Let's go for it. And a pull and a pull and a pull, pull, pull. Pulling it up, pulling it up. Up, up, up. Okay. Um, I'm tempted to use that wet paper, but I won't. Ah, I'm out of little papers. That's why I'm going to have to stop the video and cut some more. Do, 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 do. And, you know what, 
Maybe that's better to keep there for now. I really hope that the mold isn't really visible when these dry up. Oops. Um, Cause I'm planning on giving these away. Shifted. Do 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 do. It's like basically perfect. Do 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 do. Not that one though. Do 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 do. I'm hooked on a feeling. I'm high on believing. That be in love with me. Bum bum bum. Do 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 do. Okie dokies. That's the end of that. Let's put you. Yay! Oh my god! We're doing so well, I don't want to stop everybody. Um, but, alas, I think I will pin some on my own without you, but just to show off, we've got... A lo 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 a lo 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 Hello. No, I'll show you this way. Like, what's the best way to show you the work that we did? I'm exhausted! We've got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I just pinned twelve butterflies in a row. That's better. Um, and then I've got these, which I just did. Look how freaking beautiful that is! Look how freaking beautiful, everybody. That's fucking beautiful. Sorry, that's fucking beautiful. <laughs> Look how fucking beautiful. That's fucking beautiful. I love it. Freaking beautiful. Front and back. Ugh, oh, man. So we're just we're gonna have a whole bunch of butterflies, and I'm thrilled because I thought I lost them all. You know, I just, I didn't have the energy to, to pin them all, and I thought that they all went to garbage, but I was able to rehydrate them and pin them, and this is my first time really doing that. Like, I did it a little bit before, but these were big, big-ass butterflies, and they were super freaking dry. Um, my only thing is I shouldn't have left them in the hydration chambers for as long as I did because they did start getting mold. So it's like, if you don't leave them long enough, they won't be wet and they'll still be dry and crackly. But if you leave them too long, then they'll get moldy. So do, 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 do. Maybe I'll use more pine salt next time, but I don't think that's the problem. I just, I left them in there for so long. Um, some of them are missing antennas. So I'm going to have to figure out a way to like, make fake antennas and then you have to super glue them on but there's no way in hell I'm just gonna leave them without antennas so that's it that's it everybody um la, 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 la. sorry I'm moving all my crap 
Ah, <sighs> so, 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 thank you everybody for joining me, even though these are mostly for myself, or in the future, if I want to get a job that works with butterflies, I can show them how much experience I have, maybe teach a class or two, a merit badge, I don't know, Boy Scouts isn't a thing anymore, but, uh, yeah, you know, I wish there was more I could have done this year. Butterfly season's ending. It's, what, the end of September, moving into October. And I don't really see butterflies after October and November. Um, and then we're going to have winter. And <clears throat> I can't grow any host plants in the winter. And this is going to be my first year, like, actually trying to grow plants inside during the winter. I did a little bit last year, but this time it's going to be like for real, for real grow plants indoors. And that's a whole thing all in itself. You know, if you want to work with butterflies like I'm showing you, um, I'm, I'm showing you what I'm doing. You can't even see. If you want to work with butterflies, don't go out and catch butterflies. Like, don't be that guy. Um, there's there there isn't even enough as it is. Um, these were all grown in captivity from egg, literally from egg, fed as caterpillar, chrysalis, butterfly, and then taken care of as butterflies. They got their plants. I just love this job. I love butterflies. I love you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I never know how to end these videos. Bye! See you next time for maybe a drawing video or something fun.